while we are still here, I would like to take the opportunity to explain the concept of endians. When we store 16-bit data in memory, it requires 2 bytes. As we know, 16 bits equals 2 bytes, since 8 bits is 1 byte. Most computers provide a unique address for each byte. And because of this, there are two approaches for storing data in memory. There is the little endian approach and the big endian approach. So let's say we want to store 16-bit data, that is to say 2-byte data in memory. We will need two addresses like we've established. So let's say we have one address 0x2000.608 and another one 0x2000.0681. The dot here is just to make it readable. Yeah, we can clean it, but it makes it easy to look at the numbers and yeah as you can tell we put in this in the ROM just a while ago when we showed the demarcations of memory we said the ROM started from 0x2 so yeah this is the ROM area um, so we would have to put one byte uh, we would have to put one byte at one address and another byte in another address so with the big endian the most significant byte is stored at the lower address this is rather opposite for the little endian where the least significant byte is stored at the lower address you might be wondering what's the most or least significant byte um let's say we have this let's say we have this hexadecimal number 0x038a in fact um there's the hexadecimal code for the um the decimal number 1000 the first two numbers or the first two digits you know gives us one byte and the other two gives us another byte this is the most significant byte the leftmost byte is the most significant byte and the rightmost byte is the least significant byte so keep in mind with a big endian the most significant byte is stored at the lower address and with a little endian the least significant byte is stored at the lower address so let's let's look at an example let's say we want to store the same value 0x03e8 in memory and as we said it's 1000 um, let's say we want to place them in these addresses 0x2000.0680 and 0x2000.681 let's say we want to put this here as we can tell already we know 0x03e8 a 16 bit number which means we would require two bytes if we if we wanted to place a 32 bit number in memory we would require four bytes because 32 divided by 8 gives us 4 and this is because 8 bit makes one byte um, so let's just draw up a table here and try to place them let's say we have the big Indian and the little Indian the same addresses how would we do it in a big Indian computer and how would we do it in a little Indian computer with a big Indian computer we would have to put the 0x03 at the lower address uh, you know the 0x03 is the MSB the most significant byte we would have to put the other byte in the in the other address if the number were to be a 32-bit number, we would have to follow in this order. With the little Indian, it's the opposite. We have to put the least significant byte in the um in the lower address and the most significant byte in the rather higher address. So um, this is how data is placed in the big Indian and the little Indian computer. So this follows through in 32-bit numbers. Um, some microcontrollers come in big endian and others come in little endian for instance the microcontrollers made by the freescale company are big endian microcontrollers but keep in mind our cortex m uses the little endian